<coughs> hey guys, what's up? It is your boy here again. Use one Phoenix, and today I'm doing the Schlogan GT review. And the Schlogan, the Schlogan GT was released yesterday at 8:30 for for 1.3 million dollars. Now. I had already bought this car as soon as it came out so I could test it for myself. Why do I need to talk about it when I can show you it? So for that price you get a sports car, which I personally was a bit shocked because look at this thing. But listen to the sound of that engine too. It sounds amazing. And for what it is, guys... There we go. I don't know if you guys can hear me any better, because... Yeah. This car is literally a pocket rocket. Wait, for that price you get a... How do I describe it? An actual, like... A very decent super or sports car. What's that super? Okay, we'll take it over to the customs so I can show you the customization. It actually isn't too bad to drive, to be completely honest. Like, it has been my my go-to vehicle for a good while now. Why is it so loud? And the main good thing about this car, guys, is that it doesn't have any handling flags like the older cars do. But here is all the upgrades. I'm just being quiet for this section while I do this. You know, the stripe, the racing liveries for this thing. I like this. It goes good with the car. But that is the customization options now. My only problem with this review is that I've got no one to race with, so I can't really give you an exact idea on how fast this thing is. But what I am thinking of doing, guys, is basically putting a timer on my phone and then taking it around the airfield just there.
I was thinking of doing a live stream for this video, guys, but then I don't do enough video clips, in my opinion, so yeah. I think I'll get my phone. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Come on, what's the stopwatch? Alright, on three, guys, we go. The car's too loud. Okay, let's see if this makes any difference. Oh, it's much better. Alright, three, two, one, go! We're going one lap around the cell airfield. That would took me thirty three seconds point seventy eight milliseconds. There. So in my personal opinion, if you should buy this car. To be completely honest guys, I'm not a big fan of sports cars. And if you've been on my channel for a good while when I did my GTA videos earlier, you probably noticed that. I think I mentioned that uh, yeah, personally, I'm not a big fan of sports cars and, and supercars. I'm a muscle car guy, but I love this thing. But yeah, you can probably Google, or YouTube, sorry, all the, um, like some side-by-side -side comparisons between speed between, like, the Pariah and the Revolta and whatnot. But yeah. But yeah, for what you're getting is that a much more stable planted car. So in my opinion this is worth it. Not worth that 1.3 million. And plus I'm kind of stuck with that I saw Max 80 Proto for it. Yeah. So yeah. That is, that's my review of this car. But for a normal drag race, I'm not too sure how long it would take. I'll probably do one a video later later on between a sports car and another sports car. Or this and another sports car. I'll just have to get one of my mates on to give me a hand of that. But yeah. That's my review, guys. You guys will probably catch me all in the next video. Or whenever I do another one of these reviews. Jeez, so always try hard to go law. But what I'm also thinking of doing here is... So, like, you know how on YouTube they go, like, all these hero videos where, like... You see, like, like, um, high, like, some leveled players versing, like, some tryhards. I'm thinking of doing that, so... Leave your opinions in the comments below on what I should do. And that's for proof that, you, that it's got no handling flags. You can double clutch. You've always seen me do some bit of gut double clutching around these corners. Yeah, as, as you can see right now, I'm trying to do... Bugger. So yeah, I don't really like this car. Boom. And plus. 
if you guys want to know what this is based off in real life, it is based off a Mercedes AMG TT. I'm, if I'm correct. It's an AMG TT. I'm not particularly sure, but it's a Mercedes of some, some sort. But yes, there is a muscle car coming out soon that I am really looking forward to. It's called the, the um, Deviant. I'll be doing a full review on that when it comes out. Yes, I hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like, subscribe, and let me know your opinions in the comments below. Crap. Comments below on if you guys like the car as well, and what other reviews I should do. And let me know what your opinions on the idea was from earlier on, I said. Yes, that's all I've got for this video. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye.